Privacy is another big issue uh, in the web uh, environment, and some of it has to do with just the way we behave. We put up information that other people would consider uh, inappropriate or unsafe, uh, and we do it either out of ignorance, we do it out of uh, egotistical pleasure for displaying whatever it is that we're doing, um, but it does have consequences, and I think we are seeing some of those now. Uh, but we also have problems that a lot more personal information is accumulated, even in many cases perfectly legitimately. For example, uh, I worked for many years at MCI, and we accumulated a lot of information about people's calling uh, practices because we had to bill them. So we had the date and the time and the length of the call and who you called and from what number, and we used that for billing. But it's easy to see how that could be treated as very personal information as well. So the company treated it as personal and didn't release it uh, except under uh, certain legal uh, conditions. The problem is if that information happened to be in a disk drive or on a thumb drive uh, and that got lost because somebody just wasn't paying attention, uh, that's uh, another incursion uh, into personal privacy. So I see a lot of reasons why privacy gets invaded, not by intent, but simply because of, of poor practices. And, of course, there are a lot of invasive devices now. Uh, in fact, every one of us with a mobile, in a funny sense, is a source of potential personal invasion because we can take videos, we can take audio recordings, we can take pictures, we can publish them on the net, uh, and we do so uh, with uh, considerable abandon. Uh, and now people go through, for example, Flickr, and they tag uh, photographs, so all of a sudden there's a little photograph that you didn't know was being taken that identifies you being in a place where you weren't supposed to be or you said you were somewhere else and somebody says that's interesting because there's a picture of you on Flickr that says you're over here and you can't claim that it was Photoshop that did it. And so there's a whole lot of problems here with personal privacy uh, because of the fact that we've all become reporters in some sense and we've created uh, an environment where we can share that information with uh, anyone uh, that we want to.